Trees can't tell us when they're not feeling well, so how can we tell when they're sick? A tree that is infested with harmful pests will show certain symptoms of decline, such as leaf wilt. When leaves don't get enough nutrients, they turn yellow, wilt, and eventually die. Crown dieback. When branches at the top and outer edges of a tree stop producing leaves and even break apart and fall. Bark splits. Vertical splits that cause the bark to peel away from the tree. Blonding. The lighter patches where woodpeckers have stripped away bark looking for insects. Some of the most visible symptoms of a tree under stress are epicormic sprouts. These leafy shoots around the base of the trunk are an effort by the tree to grow more leaves when the crown has been damaged. Many invasive insects are wood-boring beetles, like emerald ash borer. We are in Georgia, where our neighbors are already dealing with an EAB infestation. Female beetles lay their eggs on the bark of an ash tree. The larvae hatch, drill through the bark, and the feast begins. EAB causes the most damage during this larval stage, when larvae tunnel through the soft tissue underneath the bark, called the phloem. These S-shaped larval galleries destroy the phloem, choking off the movement of nutrients in the tree. The larva then pupates and matures into a beetle before emerging from a characteristic D-shaped exit hole. In addition to larval galleries and exit holes, other signs of an infestation may include eggs on the outer bark, feeding damage on leaves, adult insects crawling or flying around, and frass. That's right, insect poop. You can protect trees and forests by reporting any time you see signs or symptoms of an invasive species using the Seedon app or directly to invasives at clemson.edu.